This is the time of the year when angels can be spotted everywhere, especially on top of Christmas trees. They also abound in the work of an artist who has gained quite a following in Hollywood. Gloria Hiller takes us to his exhibit in the City of Angels. It looked like a Hollywood premiere. Hundreds had come to the first major exhibition of an artist who paints, well, angels. The story begins nearly 2,000 angel paintings ago. Andy Lakey, the former car salesman with no artistic training, began painting angels after being visited by them, he says, following a near-death experience. The last message was, we want you to paint 2,000 angels. We'll teach you to paint, and we'll take you where you need to go. And this is where he's come. He calls them energy paintings for Steve Allen, like he asked the comedian to trace his hands. And then he writes his name, so his actual energy is locked in here. When I put the hands um, or the portrait down on it, I, it's, it's like automatic writing. I absolutely don't know what's going on, but colors come to me. It's like when I touch you, you know, for you, I feel blues and greens. For Ed Asner, it was the color blue. Some people's patterns are very simple. Some people have ordered a very small canvas. They can't fit all their energy in there. I sense the energy between us in, in that painting, which is it's kind of nice to see it in a tangible way other than just knowing it between our hearts. I've seen angels, yes. I've seen human angels. I don't know if they uh, become figments, but the human angels I've seen were well worth knowing. For the visually impaired, the artist has become somewhat of a human angel. The raised acrylic images on wood allow the paintings to be seen through touch. He has another ear. Yeah. He has a big ear and this and a small ear. <laughs> I really feel my angels and, and these, this energy is still with me, helping me create the art and deliver the art onto the wood every day. I believe that, you know, my art can be part of somebody's openness to see there's something else really out there. Angel number 2000 is to be unveiled in the year 2000, perhaps part of a bigger picture. One thing is certain, ever since the artist began painting many found themselves in the company of angels. You like it? Gloria Hillard, CNN, Los Angeles.